Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I started this video a little bit late in my construction process. That's why we're jumping right to the frame, but it's eight feet tall and took me about a week to build it. So let's get into it. So for people that aren't wood or construction savvy, this might be a bit of a challenge, but I winged the entire process without having any knowledge of how to build this kind of stuff. For most of the frame, I use two inch by three inch boards, which are lighter and cheaper than two by fours. I used foam board insulation found at any hardware store and painted it in a color that resembled gingerbread. For every screw that I'm using to attach the foam board to the frame, I used a washer as well for extra support. The windows and doors are also foam board that have been painted. I also wanted to show you guys how I did the chimney. I used styrofoam blocks that I found for free on Facebook Marketplace, used an actual brick for dimension and size, and then had to use a heat gun to do small cuts into the styrofoam. Make sure you don't go too deep because this knife gets really hot. Once you're done making your small cuts with the hot knife, you need to paint it with the same color you're using on all the gingerbread stuff. What I'm showing you here is footage from my Halloween decorations where I created these awesome columns for the entrance, but you can use it for your chimney as well. And here it is guys, the finished chimney and gingerbread house. Those white stripes you see there are white duct tape with red and green Christmas balls for added touch. I decided to add candy, donuts, cotton candy, all those cool things to my gingerbread house to give it that awesome sweet and candy look to it. I even put cupcakes on the roof, so I think we did really good here. So the corners of the gingerbread house are made from pool noodles and duct tape to resemble candy canes. So that hides any gaps or imperfections that might be on the edges of the corner. But yeah, guys, that's it. That's my gingerbread house. It was really just me experimenting on how to do this. I had never built anything like this before, but it was really fun to explore something new and change it as I went. And I'm so happy with how it turned out. Hope you guys love it too.